Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Dom from MacMixing.com, and today we're going to go over mixing vocals, specifically ones that may have not been recorded in necessarily the best mic, or may have been recorded with a mic that doesn't really work with your voice. Up in front of me here, we have a session that was sent to me by one of the YouTube viewers here. His name's E.Dizzy, a.k.a. The Famous Nobody. You can find him on Twitter. I'll have the link down there in the description, so go check him out, follow him. He's got a new album that's coming out pretty soon. Right here we have the raw vocal tracks, and it wasn't really recorded in a mic that worked too well with his voice. It didn't give him the warmth that he was looking for. So I forgot how we got talking about it, but I told him to send me a session and I mix it down for him, get his vocal sounding a little warmer. And I did that and sent it to him, and he was really happy with it and whatnot. But I decided to make a video out of it and kind of show you guys what I was doing because um, I know that maybe some of you might be faced with the same reality. I'm going to play his raw vocal tracks for you with the beat, and you can just give it a listen and see how it sounds to you. Uh, you'll notice it sounds kind of thin, maybe kind of airy. Um, but here, I'm going to go ahead and mute the stereo tracks. We don't need that right now. Yeah. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Okay, so that'll give you a good enough of idea about it. Uh, it's a little thin and airy, but he's got a lot of talent there too, so we hate to waste that with the, with the airy vocals. So I'm going to show you guys how to beef it up a little bit. You can do this with any pre, but I'm doing it with one of my Universal Audio pre's. Uh, I'm going to patch in his vocals through the Universal Audio pre, so it'll actually loop back into Pro Tools, and uh, we'll be able to get a good sound out of it. So I'm actually going to play this, and I'm just going to go ahead and uh, check the levels and get everything right. Hold on. My haters get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at the mall, smelling like strong, going harder than King Kong. Bad chickens hold my bags, buddy. I'm bad. Forget that good guy. All right, cool. So uh, I just put it in there, give it a little boost. Uh, didn't do much with it yet, but the pre actually, uh, it, it's it's pretty good. It's actually really transparent, but it'll help later on while I'm mixing the rest of it. So. Uh, what we're going to do now is uh, there's a, a go-to plugin that I have in that I really like to use. It's called CLA Vocals, part of Waves Vocal Plugins. I really like it because there's a lot you can do. It's really versatile, and uh, it just kind of is like a magic button sometimes. So I'll go ahead and select a preset here, and uh, I'm going to fine-tune it from there. Now, we have all these channels here, and I'll explain to you what they mean. Uh, right here, we have bass. Uh, we have sub, lower, and upper, and those are just uh, the different categories of frequency sets that it will strange in. Right here we have treble, has a uh, bite, top, and roof, and uh, they just kind of use it in more recognizable terms that people might understand a little better, but basically, like I said, that's just the frequency sets that you're mixing. We have a compressor here. Uh, we, we have push, spank, wall, and you know, those are all kind of self-explanatory. Uh, we do have a reverb channel, a delay channel, and then we have a, a pitch channel, which will actually let you give the vocal a stereo effect. So what I'm going to go ahead and do is play this, and I'm going to mix everything a little bit on here and just get it to where it sounded good. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at the mall. Smelling like strong, going harder than King Kong. Bad chickens hold my bags. Buddy, I'm bad. Forget that good guy shit. Losers finish last. I've never been a loser, nigga. Gone with all of that. Because even Keenan and Kale will tell you I'm all dead. Dressed all right, that sounds good to me. I, I got rid of a lot of that unwanted trouble and airiness that we had in the initial vocal. Um, and uh, what we're going to go ahead and do here, I'm going to add a little bit of slap to this. Uh, for me, slap kind of just fills it up a little bit. It makes it a little fuller than it usually is sometimes. So hold on, I'm going to add that real quick. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at the mall. Smelling like strong going. All right, cool. So now I'm going to solo the vocal so you can kind of hear what it sounds like raw. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at. All right, so I warmed it up a little bit here. I'll, I'll, I'll do you an A B with it. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at the mall. Smelling like strong, going harder than King Kong. As you can tell, the difference is uh, like night and day on just that right there. But I'm going to go ahead and do a, a few other things with it. 
Uh, I'm going to add in my insert chain is uh, some reverb, and I really like to use rverb. It's got a pretty good effect to it, and uh, I usually go ahead and load up Studio A, and uh, I know I'm going to have to change that from there. Uh, but let's go ahead and listen to it, and I'll bring everything to where it needs to go. <laughs> I'm all dead, dressed in all black, looking like the Reaper. You can tell I'm getting money just by looking at my sneakers. Gucci bumping from my speakers. Burr, burr, burr. You ain't got it like the. All right, cool. So now we have uh, it sounding normal again. It didn't sound like it was in the hallway anymore. Um, but it put that reverb behind it, and it really just that with the slap and then combined with the warmth that I added, it really thickens everything up a lot. Uh, and obviously, going through the UA pre helps a lot too, but. You know, these are just simple things that you can do to uh, fix a vocal. Uh, you can't, you know, you can't polish a turd. I mean, I know you guys have heard that before, but I don't think this is a turd. I just think there were some qualities about it that weren't necessarily desirable, and we were able to get those out of there by doing this. The thing I'm going to do is I'm going to add some EQ and I'm going to add a limiter. Um, I also uh, f forgot to mention that in the beginning, of, before I started all this, and it really doesn't matter when you do this, but I went into Audio Suite here, into Dynamics, and I pulled up C1 Comp, the C1 Compressor. It's very good, and I usually honestly just put it on the classic compressor setting and just apply it to the waveform, and it really levels everything out. You see how it's nice and even. There's not a whole lot of peaks there. It really levels everything out and a little easier to work with. Um, so I'm going to play this. I'm going to add this EQ real quick. Hold on. Dizzy mom, smelling like strong, going harder than King Kong. Bad chickens hold my bags, but a young bad. Forget that good guy shit, losers finish last. I've never been a loser, nigga, gone with all of that. Because even Keenan and Kale will tell you I'm all dead. Dressed in that works. Now I pulled a little bit of the high mid range out, and then I pulled some of the upper highs out. And that really got rid of all those undesirable qualities to me that I didn't like, in my in my opinion, actually. And then, obviously, we're going to go ahead and take the limiter and uh, uh, damn near nice and uh, compressed, you know, nice and tight. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Catch me at the mall. Smelling like strong, going harder than King Kong, bad chicken. Now we have a nice compressed vocal, uh, something that's going to be really easy to work with. No mix. It gives us a pretty good vocal mix and... Uh, as far as sound goes, I mean, obviously we have to mix it in, but just using these simple little steps here, you can actually transform a vocal. And now, what I did here is I used a CLA vocal plugin, I used Rverb, I used Q4 just to just to take out some of those little frequencies I didn't like, and I used the L2 limiter, which is uh, one of my favorite limiters here in in our in the Waves bundle that I have. And uh, I'll go ahead and AB these vocals. The first one I'm going to play is the one that he sent me. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. All right, so uh, now here's uh, what I mix for him. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. PSA to all my haters. Get off for young and balls. Ain't no room for all of y'all. Now, you can do. I mean, we went from, we went day and night on this. This is the original one. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. And this is the remixed one. Dizzy, dizzy, uh, hotter than them all. So we got a lot bigger tone out of that. We made it a lot warmer, and uh, we ultimately got a better sounding vocal out of it and was able to save the performance here so you didn't have to re-record it. So, you know, I hope this was helpful for you guys. Um, just go ahead and go over to the website, you know, comment. I have a new forum up now. Uh, if you guys have any questions, anybody want to post music in there, just show off, whatever. It's free, you know, it's uh, it's up on MacMixing.com, so go ahead and check it out. Also, follow me on Twitter, at MacMixing, links are in the description. And uh, go ahead, e.dizzy, his Twitter is in the description as well. It's at the famous nobody, T-H-A. Check out the forum, uh, thanks for all you guys' support. Go ahead and comment on the video, like it, whatever, you know, poke it, you know, stuff like that. So, anyways, thanks for giving me time, you guys, and uh, hope to talk to you soon. Thanks.